Hey guys, so I got this log right here. A couple of trees fell near it, so I picked up a nice piece of log pine. It smells great. My sap in it. So I'm gonna try to turn this into something. I'm thinking like a little little table or something. Could be. That's what I'm gonna do. I got another one over there. There's another piece back there. I think this is the nicer one, and I'm gonna work with that. Let's see what I come up with. So guys, just before I get any farther, I use a saw over here, hand saw. Cut away the edges of it. See that? It looks a lot clearer. And also ripped apart a lot of the loose bark. Like if you could compare to this one, you can see the edges are sticking out, the bark is all loose and cracky. That's what I just cleaned up. So here's my section of wood. I've been sanding it really well. It's not look quite nice, eh? It's got a nice character. Unusual colorations here, I'm not sure what. I kind of like even the crack here. And the knob too gives a nice look. There's the wood too, the roots. I've been sanding them down and I just put them side by side like this. And this is kind of the rough feet that they're gonna be. I just gotta put screws in here, cut the top off smooth. Got this big ass uh, bolt, I might be using that to go for the top. And for this, I think that's my ideas. Yeah, I might be doing that. It's gonna be tough going for this one. Oh, I know that for sure. Anyway, that's the idea, guys. And I've been sanding this slowly, but not too much. I want to give some of the character of the old look. Then I'll put a nice coating on it. So, first bolt is in. This guy, big bolt, and right through. And it's, you know, I'm trying. To, it's quite sturdy already. Obviously, it's proper leveling off. I'm gonna get smaller ones here because that's a little too big, and then we'll, I'll cut the top off. Hey guys, so I'm using the sander here, powered sander, to sand the top of this and make it smooth. And then all I have to do is put this on top. So obviously, it's not balanced yet, but it's almost there. It's gotta keep sanding this in, and it'll be pretty flush. It's getting there, guys. It's starting to look nice. Well, it's assembled. There's a screw holding it. I kind of like it, the rough look. I do like the rough look. I'll see how it looks once I put a nice bit of coating on it. So here's the stain I'm using. Paraffin Classic Maple Wood Stain. I'm just gonna go over. I'm gonna start just down here first. Let's see how that looks. Oh yeah, it's not bad. Should be a lot lighter than this, but I'm just gonna keep going all over this. Give it a few coats, at least one, probably at least two, sorry. And I'm just gonna keep covering every nooks and cranny. I'll show you how it looks at the end, guys. Talk to you later. Hey guys, so I'm pretty much done with this guy here. Now I'm just adding a clear coat. I'm sorry, that's the French side. There we go. There's a clear coat. I want to have a bit of a more wet look on top. You can see it has that here. I just put a layer of it there. Here it's a little glossy from the stain too. But I'm gonna give everything a clear coat and show you how that comes out. Hopefully that makes it a bit more protective too. Hey guys, so here's the final result of my little stool table. I'm gonna dry it up, it's got a nice glossiness to it. I like that. And there's the bottom of the roots. See, there's a bolt. Can't even make out the screw down there, barely. It's my first attempt and uh, I like it. Thanks for watching guys.